Hello and welcome back to trending videos. Don't forget to subscribe, give us a thumbs up and remember to click on that bell in order to get notifications every time we upload a new video. Now it has been one week since Eliud Kipchoge ran a marathon in under two hours, clocking one hour, 59 minutes and 40 seconds during the iNews challenge in Vienna, Austria. Now a debate has emerged about his shoes. Kipchoge used the Nike Vaporfly Next Percent, a special type of shoe which is said to have carbon fiber plates in the midsole. Now Ryan Hall, who is now a retired marathoner and finished 10th in the Beijing Olympics marathon, said that the shoe might have handed Kipchoge an advantage. And this is what he said. With all due respect to Kipchoge, he is clearly the greatest marathoner of all time regardless of the shoe he is in. But when a shoe company puts multiple carbon fiber plates in a shoe with a cushion between the plates, it is no longer a shoe. That is what Hall wrote on his Instagram. He says it's a spring and a clear mechanical advantage to anyone in those shoes. I'm just hoping the International Amateur Athletics Federation, that is the IAF, makes sure that upcoming Olympics and World Marathon majors are fair playing fields for athletes of all brands. Now Trevor Noah, being the comedian that he is, could mold it up and he challenged those who are talking about Kipchoge's shoes giving him an unfair advantage above others and he asked them to wear the shoes and attempt to complete the marathon in under two hours and this is what he said why don't you get those shoes and you tell me how fast your time is you can't give the shoes the credit if anything him meaning kipchoge being kenyan is the cheating part he wasn't like oh my god i'm wearing these nikes it's more like the next were saying Oh my god, I'm wearing a Kenyan. We're going to win. We're gonna win. That is what Trevor Noah said. Now, what do you think? Do you think Kipchoge won the marathon because of the shoes? Or do you think he won the marathon because he is a talented athlete? That's for you to ponder. Thank you so much for tuning in for today's video. Remember to subscribe. Click the notification bell and see you in our next video. Till then, bye-bye.